Now, your Super Doppler 10 forecast with meteorologist Steve Fundero. All right, we got a beautiful day expected today. Why? Because we're getting some rainfall. That's for sure. You know, June has been running dry, 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 dry. Past 10 days have seen almost nada. We're two and a half inches behind schedule where we should be getting some shower activity around for the day today. That's great stuff. Seeing some outside right now. We'll get to radar in a little bit. Better chance of some rainfall later on this week too, Thursday, and then maybe by the weekend on Sunday. So we'll take anything uh, we can get here. Some shower activity. A few uh, rumbles of thunder across the south side here. Some light rain on the northern end of VB here, but there's going to be some rainfall continuing through the 264 uh, area there around Virginia Beach Boulevard and right through uh, the um, um, 64 corridor of the south side here. Chesapeake, Portsmouth, Norfolk. We're getting some heavy rain at times and a couple of rumbles of thunder here. So this is all beneficial stuff. It's sub severe, likely not going to cause any damage or issues, but it will keep the roadway slick this morning. So use some caution if you're driving around. Uh, we got some uh, water on the roads there and could uh, make it a little bit slick out there. Some lightning activity, lots of lightning activity out towards Pop Road Branch. Going to get you again in Kerala there. Saw some heavy rain earlier this morning, closer to about 5 a.m. We're not done after this morning's rainfall. We're going to see another round late morning through the mid afternoon with temperatures holding in the 80s for our day today. So cooler than yesterday for sure. Uh, yesterday we hit 99, tied a record high. However, it's still really humid outside for our afternoon and that will make it potentially feel close to, to about 90 degrees, if not the low 90s, if that sun peaks itself out in between any of the showers or thunderstorms today. All thanks to this cool front dropping in, acting enough as a trigger to spark some of these uh, showers and thunderstorms. That pushes south later on this evening, sets up a really, really nice evening for us, and then a really beautiful day tomorrow. Nothing but sunshine. Highs back in the uh, mid and upper 80s, where they should be this time of year, so feeling warm in the sunshine. However, the dew points are way down. Bottom of the scale, likely on either side of 60 degrees. That's for Tuesday. That's going to be our brief little window where we get some relief from that heat and humidity before it all comes back on Wednesday. We're going to see those temperatures climb to the mid 90s. Humidity comes back in full force, likely feeling closer to about 100 degrees on our Wednesday. So future track has our shower and thunderstorm activity continuing uh, through the mid morning hours, then comes back by late morning into mid afternoon, drifting from north to south. So we'll see some shower and thunderstorms develop likely across the peninsulas in the south side and then pushing south through about four or five o'clock across the Albemarle Sound. So kind of fast moving here and they're not going to soak us and it's not going to be an all day event, but we'll get some rainfall and we need it for sure. After that, we see skies clear out. The rain fades overnight. Tuesday is that beautiful day with some sunshine and a relatively lower humidity values. Temperatures in the upper 80s for us Tuesday. Then then we're heating back up on Wednesday for another dose of rainfall arrives on our Thursday. Taking any chance of rain we can get.